This is not just a DC generated problem. This isn't just political posturing. Is there political posturing going on? I'm sure there is. But the real heart of the problem is out in the, in the, in the country where a majority of people do not think we should increase the debt limit. And it would be catastrophic if we don't, and that catastrophic is not an overstatement, if we do not increase the debt limit. When you listen to your reports from Greece, I mean, the country, the world right now, default is a very, very highly charged economic, emotional, political word. And to, to, to risk this, they, in, in, in engineering, they have a thing called expected value. Even though there is a very small percentage chance of, of a big thing happening, it's really more important than something that has a, a, a bigger percentage but is small. This is a gigantic I impact, and we all have to get serious about it. And I think the way to look at this thing uh, is to go back and look at what uh, Erskine Bowles and Senator Alan Simpson and the financial board came up with in terms of the way to deal with this thing. I think that's, you know, that's the answer. It all has to be on the table. Uh, you know, the president's pulled off increases for over 250000 There's got and tax increases, but it's another way to look at revenue. Well, look, if a business is faced with a problem like this one where they're going to go into bankruptcy, they don't just look at their expenses. They look at what their revenues are.